All right, uh, here we are with week four of the OFC. We basically have to win to try to make playoffs. We're on three, of course. Um, so, yeah, uh, I don't have a lot of time, so let me just get through this as quickly as possible. As you can see, Melbourne Sparklers and uh, Nith. I think that's it's Nith. That's my opponent for this week. Um, very powerful team, as you can see. A few different threats we got to watch out for. So, uh, we got Fizz Death. Venusaur, um, it's great for Weavile, uh, it's not great for Mega Deancey because Mega Deancey can Psychic, which it probably will bring, um, Blaze, it's great for Blaziken too, which is mainly what it's, it's main, mainly here for the Weavile and the Blaziken, you can also deal with like Venusaur, Porygon, Gashadon, uh, maybe Galvantula, I don't know, if it's like a physical non-setting up Aegislash we can deal with that, but, um, yeah, that's what this mod's for. We got Mandibuzz, Spideff. This one's for Aegislash. Um, just because I, I want to have two separate things for Aegislash in case it brings, you know, one or the other set. But, I mean, even a Fizz Def, or even a Physically Offensive Aegislash doesn't deal with this mod too well. So, because uh, I can just foul play it. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's really what this mod's for. I mean, it's not really great for anything else. So, um... I don't really know why I brought it. I already had the battle, so whatever. Uh, it's great for it's great for Venusaur if he brings it. Um, but yeah. Uh, next up we got Prophet, the Cobalion. Speed creep and something. I think just like a max speed DNC that isn't timid or jolly or naive or hasty, whatever it is. Um, I don't really know why I would prep for that, but whatever. I guess it's just so that if he is modest or whatever that I can outspeed him. Uh, so we got the rocks. His only defogger is Latias. Uh, he's got magic bouncing Deancey, Mega Deancey and Zatu, but I don't see Zatu coming and Mega Deancey's got a Mega first, so I'm probably just gonna leave with this, try to get my rocks up and go from there. Uh, and then just dual stab. We got Banded uh, Zygarde. Banded Zygarde is awesome. Deals with, uh, I'm outspeeding Mega Deancey with this uh, amount of speed. And yeah, a thousand arrows just kind of bulldozes his team. I mean, once I whittle a few things, I need to whittle the Gashadon a little bit. I need to whittle the P2 a little bit. Um, and then hopefully go from there. So, uh, yeah, that's that's about that with, with that mod. That's about it. Uh, then I got Wazoo, Gardevoir. I feel like bringing Gardevoir, even if it doesn't have the best matchup, just. Just cause I actually changed this. I didn't have lefties. I had uh, Cassie Berry. Um, cause I was thinking maybe I can take a hit from Age Slash, but I, but it was like last minute. I wasn't thinking. Wait, Age Slash can just fucking Iron Head me, so it's not gonna matter. Um, but maybe if it tries to Shadow Snake me, cause I, I, my, I might be faster than it. Um, cause I have no speed. But if Age Slash has no speed, like Age Slash is really slow, so if it doesn't have any speed, then I could uh, deal with it pretty well. Um, and he'd have to shadow some eat, sneak me. That's the idea behind the Cassie Berry. Um, Call my Draining Kiss Psychic Shadow Ball. Uh, it wasn't really, a, I didn't feel like the, the Salic Berry kind of thing would work because he's got priority in Aegislash and Weavile, um, both of which are pretty strong. And I'm not really strong on the physical defense side. So, yeah, I just felt like maybe maybe a bulkier set with Call Mine would work. But uh, last but not least, we got Koba. Which just barely will outspeed the Weavile, which lets us run Adamant, or in this case, Naughty. Um, Plasma Fizz Bolts, which close combat and Grass Knight. Grass Knight's great for uh, uh, the Gashadon, which could could be a little bit annoying. So, uh, yeah, we'll go from there. But uh, Extra Belt, just because I didn't think of a different item. So, there it is. Alright, uh, I'm, I'm going to cut to the battle. All right, sorry for that uh, kind of abrupt uh, cutting there. My video kind of cut off a little bit. So um, here we are in the battle, as you can see, he's got the uh, a number of different threats. I think he, he had 10 mods to start, so he didn't bring Blaziken, Zatu, Venusaur, or P2. So it's kind of nice to not say P2, because that thing's annoying. So um, I think I just leave Koba just to try to get up, uh, rocks, because if he leads Deancey, he's probably gonna switch. Um, cause I can freaking kill it really easily, so, um, 
Yeah, but I really think, I mean, honestly, I, I prepped for this uh, battle so quickly that, like, I saw Galvantula, but I didn't bring, uh, I didn't bring removal because his only removal is defog, so he'd be getting rid of the sticky webs if he brought it, but, um, stick, like, looking at my team, sticky webs are just so much better. They're, they're so much more valuable than, than keeping rocks off of his side of the field, so, um, probably should have brought the, uh, defog on Mandibuzz. Um, I think I made it boots last second too. I don't know if it's, is it, was it boots in the team prep? Oh, it was. Okay, never mind. Uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna start the start the battle here. Um, so yeah, let's see how they go. let's see how this goes. Uh, he clicks the sticky web as I click the stealth rocks. Um, so again, not the best. Uh, now he's gonna volt switch out. Uh, I think I just volt switch here. I was hoping he would bring Gastron, but of course he does. So. Um, I mean, he could have just thundered, probably, because <laughs> I don't know why he would switch there, honestly. He could have just clicked thunder, because I couldn't really do much to it. Uh, so I bring in a bridge here, so you guys are yawn, which is a little bit annoying. But I just click le leech seed, because nothing, nothing's going to soak that up. So uh, at least I'll get a little bit of residual damage on something. I do land, which is great. But now I'm asleep, and I can't stay in against uh, a Latias. So I'm going to have to switch on out of here. I go to Mandibuzz, which is Spidef, which is great for this mod. Because even if it's like if it's like uninvested ice beam or thunderbolt, it's not going to do much to me. So now I'm going to click U-turn, knowing that he's either going to defog or he's going to switch, and he probably doesn't defog because webs are really good against me, uh, which again I didn't really notice. <laughs> so I'm going to trace the clear body. Doesn't do much for me. Um, sorry about that. Doesn't do much for me. Uh, he's going to go into Aegislash. slash. I just make the safe psychic play. Uh, I really did want to predict that go for Shadow Ball, but I did not, uh, in case he stayed in, tried to Diamond Storm me or something. Um, so he goes for Iron Head here, Blood Race can take this really well. I didn't want to go into Venusaur because I didn't want to get chipped down and I'm asleep, so I'd have to, I haven't even burnt a turn of sleep, so um, I'm going to have to be really cautious with the Venusaur, I still want it for Weavile. Uh, so I trace the, comp the compound eyes, as you can see here. As he goes for Volt Switch, gets right back into H Slash again, just not, not really predicting it. Um, now, here I stay in because I was hoping that he'd go for a Ghost type move or maybe set up or something, so I click Shadow Ball. Um, Mandibuzz doesn't take two more Iron Heads anyway, so um, just, you know, wasn't, wasn't doing much for me. Um, so, here he's gonna stay in, click the King Shield. There's, not, there's no drawback to that uh, for him. Um, so, yeah, Thousand Arrows gets protected. Now I'm thinking, well, it's still spamable against his team, so I'm just going to go for it. As he has the Shuckaberry, but he's he's not nearly healthy enough to take that. I am banded, so um, that's not a problem. Now here I got to switch, because... Oh, wait, no, I don't even switch. I just stay in and let my Zygarde die, because there's nothing to switch in. I could have... I really should have switched into Koba there, but uh, it is what it is, because I, I probably take a hit from, from Galvantula, and Gashadon, so um, could have just sacked Koba. But this is just a losing fight for me at this point. Um, I go into Venusaur. I need the two turn wake, or the first turn wake to, to have a shot at um, dealing with this mod. And I actually do get it, so that's really nice. Uh, so I'm going to get the synthesis off. Without that, I might have just gotten swept right there, honestly. Because um, I'm just not prepared at all for a, for a yawn Gashadon. <laughs> So I get a leech sheet off, which is great, because I knew he wasn't going to stay in there. Um, Honeycomb comes in as he's going to roost, which is really annoying. Uh, at this point, I don't even have knockoff on Zera, so I don't even know if um, I'm going to be able to beat this thing at all. So I go for a U-turn, um, does about a quarter of his health, so Cabalion comes back in. Uh, and I am offensive, but uh, I don't have any... Um, I don't have any like boosting move. I probably should have like should have had life orb. If I was like life orb adamant, this would be doing really well. But he outspeeds me, so that means he's probably like he's got a lot of speed and he's probably like also max HP. Maybe maybe he's got defense or something. I don't know. So I just volt switch here. I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing. Um, I think it was right there that I realized he didn't have knockoff um, on Zero Aura, which would have been nice because. Um, I would have taken any hit from this on, and it, it wasn't Culber, I was feel, I was feeling like it was Culber Berry, but it was actually Yachi Berry, um, so, uh, that's, that's that.
Uh, he's going to bring in Garnet here. I do get the fully para. I did U-turn, so it would have been really nice to get that U-turn uh, off. Um, into, into the Koba would have been really good. Um, is he going to go for a, he's gonna go for a Calm Mind? <laughs> um, that's the move. And I'm thinking, okay, he's going to Earth Power, but he actually goes for the Moon Blast. Um, which will knock me out anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um, and then I know he's going to have Psychic here, so um, he actually goes for Calm Mind. Which I didn't like at first, just because I'm like, okay, you've already won, clearly, like, I can't kill you with a Giga Drain. Um, but he's just being safe, I can respect that, there's, there's nothing wrong with it, inherently. Um, it's just, it's just annoying to just keep losing over and over and over, there's just, I, I don't know. I, just like, even when I started the battle, I just didn't feel like I cared for anything, so. Uh, I'm not gonna quit the league, because, um, it's... It, it, it's not right to do that. You shouldn't start something um, and then not quit and then just quit because that's gonna first of all It's gonna lose me a lot of cred credibility with people But it's also just not very nice to do to people It just puts more stress stress on them than they have to and I'm not gonna be a crybaby about it I'm just not doing well. I'm like one and eight total in all the leagues I've in all the league battles. I've been posting on YouTube. I was doing better before that like I remember um, not just like way like not just like years back in like gen 7 and like omega ruby alpha sapphire leagues but like even you know a month ago or so i was in a few leagues and i was doing pretty well um but right now it's just i don't know i think it's just more competitive because like also when i was when i was doing it a few years ago i'd like consistently be making playoffs or at least put myself in a position to make playoffs like i would always be over 500 in leagues and um or at least at 500 so uh, this this league is I mean is different. I think it's just the, it's more competitive. There's better players. There's better players now um, that I'm against. So um, yeah, that's gonna be it. Uh, again, I'm not gonna quit. I'm just not gonna put as much effort. I'm just not feeling it right now. So um, I'm not gonna put as much effort into building. But that's that's fine. I mean, if, if I'm a free win to people, then all the more power to them. You know, I don't really doesn't really make a difference to me so uh yeah thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video i don't know what it'll be but um yeah i'll see you then